you guys, welcome to One Coin Only. It's absolutely awesome to have you here once again, guys. We've got a special treat for you today, as I like to always think I have, because I like to give treats. I'm the candy man. That makes no sense, but we're going to move on. This is the One Coin Only shop if you want to support the brand and look sexy at the same time. This is the place to go. Thank you for your support. Uh, we have a game called Dead Cells today, guys. This is just literally left early access on the Steam store. It's a roguelike slash metroidvania, castlevania style game apparently from what I hear. It's absolutely awesome. Uh, a big thank you to John Price for donating this to us today. And uh, it's supposed to be very, very good. I have never ever played this game before. And uh, we're going to dive in now and we're going to see what it's like. How you doing Stacy? Good to see you girl. <clears throat> oh, thank you very much Ryan. I haven't... Where did you send it Ryan? Because I was trying to look for your message. I couldn't find it on... I couldn't find your message on one coin only. And I couldn't find your message on my personal page, so I don't know where you sent it, brother. Did you send it to Xbit or something? I, I couldn't, oh, yeah, that's really strange. Anyway, how you going today, guys? Good to see you, Ryan, Ben, Stacy Solvinson, how you doing? Antonio, how you doing? <coughs> oh, baby's gonna be there in an hour. Oh, bro, congratulations, that's awesome. So happy for you, sir. Finally came. <laughs> So this is like a Castlevania, Metroidvania style game. I can collect all sorts of different weapons, I guess. Uh, Alright, we'll just keep moving, I suppose. Let's have a look at what this game has to offer, hey? How do you double jump? Hey, how you doing, Sorcerer Gaming? Really good to see you. How you doing, Adrian? <coughs> Personal messenger. I'll have a look. I think, okay. I don't know why I couldn't find it. How you doing, Hitmonkey? Really good to see you, my friend. Am I the headless fellow that's been getting around? Apparently so. Cat got my tongue. Apparently so as well. <laughs> Alright, man. Good luck with everything. Can't wait to see the little one. As I said, this is my first time play. I don't really understand it, but you're not the first to find yourself in this situation, if that's what you want to know. It's really strange. Can we just go kill stuff now? Okay, so let's double jump. Let's keep going. Uh, okay. We got a secondary weapon now. How do you hold the shield? So you got a choice, alright cool, you got a choice between a shield or a whatever. Let's keep going, what's this one? <laughs> I'm still, you mad? What's wrong here, monkey? Why are you mad? Thank you Ryan, appreciate it brother. And uh, where's this one going? Because we don't need anything there. Because you see it's very simply the night like this game. But it's procedurally generated I think, maybe? I'm not sure. Like, you're gonna die a lot. This is another 2D sort of like Dark Souls type of game, from what I know. What's happening today, guys? Anyway, I'm still a little bit sleepy. I probably should have waited before I came on, but I've got a big day today and I need to get as many streams on as possible. So, uh, you know, start a conversation, guys. Keep me awake. Talk about the wrestling, the weather, I don't care. How, how do I get up there again? Dodge. Okay, well. Oh, there we go. That's really hard. Okay, we got up there though. That's amazing. <clears throat> oh, Sorcerer Gaming knows about this game. I know nothing. I mean, John was kind enough to donate this to me. I never even heard of it until he did. Uh, okay, Scroll of Power upgrades one of your three stats. Alright. Alright, see. 15 plus damage with red items. Well, we have a red item on, so yeah, let's do that. That's nice. I'm kind of like, he's sort of like Alucard, you know, he's got a, a sword and everything. Pretty cool. Oh, I'm sorry, Hitmonkey, I, I totally get it. Oh, this is a big map, isn't it? Is there any other way to pull up the map bigger? Yeah, you can press select. 
Jesus looks like it's gonna be a big ass map. <laughs> it looks pretty cool. I mean, it plays better than Road Legacy. Road Legacy for me is a fun game, but maybe a little bit too cartoony. But this seems awesome. These enemies are very, very similar to the enemies in um, Circle of the Moon as well. Yeah, it's interesting. Yeah, it does look a little bit similar to the Bloodstained game, doesn't it? I totally see that. What's this thing? So, uh, yeah, I'll pick up some grenades. Why not? Still learning. Is this? Is this? So, okay. So you can use that to teleport to other parts. Cool. What's in here? Oh, this. Everything must go. I can't afford it. Making me buy stuff I can't afford. How dare you? I wonder if you lose all your weapons and stuff when you die for the first time. I mean, What's this thing? A magnificent stone worth. Wow, that's a lot of money. Uh, press the wrong button. <coughs> Just wait for them to go past. <laughs> Very harsh, but very fair from the sound of it, the monkey. Oh, gosh. Hey, how are you today, Stace? How are you feeling? Oh, I'm going to keep moving down here, apparently. Promenade of the Condemned. So I guess this is a new level. That's cool. Let's go. <laughs> oh, I, I see. I'm, 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 I'm glad you guys are all looking out for me because I actually, as I said, I've never heard of this game. But uh, some, uh, some people were talking about this in the chat the other day, and John donated it to me. How you doing, Brian? Good to see you today, man. How you doing, Ryan? We got Ryan and Brian. You guys could like be bro uh, brothers, cause that right? That's okay. Maybe not. <laughs> What's happening, fellas? You good? Get, bring me the cells you gather from others in exchange I'll procure a few useful little items for you. Okay, so this does seem a bit similar to Rogue Legacy. So, I've got nine cells. Unlocks a health potion that can be used at any time. Uh, Alright, guess we'll... Reserves up to $3,000 when you die. That's kind of important. We'll get that next time. Okay, so left trigger for hold to heal. That's pretty cool. Okay, now we're ready to go. What's in here? And just getting back to the comments. Sorry about that, guys. I was just figuring it out. How you doing, Chris? You reckon I should do a 24 hour Stardew Valley stream? Would anyone want to watch that, though? I actually, um. Ooh, okay. I actually know how to play Stardew Valley. Really enjoy that game. Oh, also, <laughs> I want some ribeye. How do you get through there? Has to be open from somewhere else. Okay, well, we'll keep going. Yeah, don't. please don't drink anymore, Stacy. We care about your health. Alright, we're going to go in here, maybe. Where are we supposed to go? Oh, don't let, don't this, let this be another one of those games that I get stuck in. Funny, they look a little like me. Oh, they are. <laughs> How you doing, Aaron? It's good to see you, man. This has already sold over 3 million copies. Or oh, you mean Stardew Valley has. Because I'm not surprised about that either. You can't open it from here. Well, where am I... Anyone know where I'm supposed to go? Maybe it's a... Maybe I need to buy Mutation, who knows. Okay, now that's pretty cool. Just buy that. So we do more damage, whatever. Why, why can't I get out of here? Anyone know what to do? This makes no sense. Oh, now I can leave. I had to buy something first, apparently. That's really stupid. Anyway, let's go. Keep going. <coughs> 
Sardew Valley with 3 million. That's such a great game. That kind of... Like, Harvest Moon was absolutely awesome back in the day, but... Just the amount of, like, things that you can do in Stardew Valley, it's just kind of put Harvest Moon to shame. I can understand why it's so popular. It's a fun game. I just don't know if people like to watch it. You know, it's different. there's a difference between playing it and actually watching it. Nah. But, uh, yeah, maybe it's just me. I'd, I'd personally watch uh, Stardew Valley. Why not? It's peaceful. Nah. Oh crap. There's a lot going on out here. I'm out of potions too. I don't even know where I'm going yet guys, I'm still learning. How you doing Josh? It's really good to see you today man, you're not late, we've only been here for a few minutes. Rare blueprint, knife dance, okay, we've got a knife dance going here. Ah, uh, now I'm dead. <laughs> 20. Yeah, it might be right, Sorcerer Gaming. I could probably finish the whole game, hopefully. <clears throat> oh, gross. <laughs> oh, try again. Back already? Yeah. Let's see what happens now. Yeah, it's definitely procedurally generated. So that's that's a real cool thing about this game. Every time you play through, uh, the dungeon, the map, and everything's going to be completely different. So it's a fresh, ex kind of like a fresh experience every time. Like the bosses and all that are always the same, um, but the game rotates around, which is pretty neat. Um, probably better to take that and get dudes from a distance. <clears throat> Alright, so that's a teleport zone. We don't need that right now. Oh, Adrian, it's my pleasure, bro. What a problem. What's this thing? There we go, some gold. So yeah, the, the object of this game is uh, to upgrade all your stuffs, and then as you get stronger, you'll be able to get further and further and further. Very similar to the Rogue Legacy game that we played. Big drop, actually. Yeah, this is pretty cool. As I said, it's a first time play, and my first impressions in this are pretty freaking awesome. It's overwhelming, though. Like, uh, the game honestly looks so big, it's a little bit hard to, I suppose, follow where you're going. But I guess as you get familiar with what you're doing, you get used to it. Down there, you can always press select and there's as many places we can go. What else is happening today, guys? A blueprint, blood sword. So, I guess the blood sword, sword is like a sword that's gonna like drain health and attack people, so we need to save up the money to buy it. Oh, we got your sucker. What's this one? Upgrade to stat, that's pretty cool. Um, plus 15 damage with red items. Well, we got a, we got a red item on. There you go, that works. Thank you very much, Ben. Really appreciate that, sir. I'm going to come on once once more today over on uh, Facebook as well, guys. Uh, also, don't forget today we've got uh, Headlock Gaming on with Combat of the Milk Models. So, uh, very big day on one coin. Pretty excited. What's up here? Yeah. Scroll of power. Upgrades. Okay, we've got another upgrade. And you're bringing home the new sofa and couch you bought last week. That's alright, man. That sounds pretty neat. A little bit more comfort for you. Oh, man. We gotcha. Got nothing on me, sir. Alright. 
there's another teleport zone. So yeah, all those zones will help you zip between every part of the castle really easily. Oh, maybe I have to jump on the other one. Get him. Oh, I'm just going to leave him alone. He seems like he's more trouble than what he's worth. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's, it comforts everything, man. Totally get it, man. It's awesome. Exactly, you got to get yourself something nice from time to time. I haven't. I just don't think we're supposed to be here miserable all the time. You know what I mean? <laughs> Buying you a nice couch makes you feel good, bro. Power to you, seriously. Firebrand. Uh, well, there we go. Let's see how we go with that. Alright, we've got another school here. Shield, electric whip, ooh. Ah, that looks pretty good. Oh, okay, now it's not as strong as what we've already got. So we might leave that one go. Alright, I'm gonna keep moving. Yeah, Stacy, I'm curious too. What did you get? <laughs> Alright, so we've got the second area. Let's just double check our map. You don't want to go too far ahead, actually. We should probably teleport. Um, let's see where that takes us. Yeah, we'll go to the. There's a few places I want to check out. Because with each additional area, it gets harder and harder and harder. And the whole point of this is to grind for as long as you can in the easier sections to get more stuff, if that makes sense. I think it makes more sense, hopefully. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're just going to look in here quickly. Oh, so we can't go that way either? I guess we are pretty much blocked off from... Oh well, we're going to go back in the teleport, I guess. Alright, we can go to the promenade now. This is good to double check. And, uh, there we are. Awesome. <clears throat> yeah, that sounds great. It sounds very comfortable. I'm, I'm so happy your house is all getting in order and stuff. I, you, I saw the photos you left of your new place and everything. Stacy looks really, really nice. Well, well, look who's here. Yeah, it's me again. Just keep going. Maybe I have to... One mutation available. That's a prerequisite of leaving. Ah, who cares? Doesn't matter if it's new or used, if you enjoy it. And it sounds like it's still in good quality, so that's awesome. And a uh, big thank you to everyone who's just joined us. Um, welcome to One Point Only, guys. I'm just going to explain what this game is once again for everyone who just joined us. This is a game called Dead Cells, guys. Uh, this is a roguelike Metroidvania style game. Uh, it keeps procedurally generating uh, whenever you die. This is kind of like a 2D Dark Souls. Uh, oh, this door was sealed two minutes ago. Well, that sucks. And yeah, you're going to die a lot. It's all about like leveling up, powering up more. And, uh, getting better with each additional gameplay. And, uh, I'm, I'm literally playing this for the first time, guys, so we're all in it together. It's a little bit overwhelming at first, but I feel like, um, slowly starting to get my head around how this game works, and, uh, maybe we can get to our first boss battle in this stream. Hopefully that will, uh, work out for us. There we go, we've got a few blueprints here. You'll find all sorts of different weapons, or blueprints for weapons as you travel. So there's, uh, I guess you could say there's a big loot system in this. I just got deaded. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Totally. Oh, we're going to try again. <laughs> Get my ass handed to me. Yeah, 
And uh, I do apologize. I'm usually a bit more of an energetic host. I'm still waking up. I think I overslept today, to be honest, which is very rare for me. So I just had some breakfast and stuff. But uh, I think what I really need is sugar or something, and I've got none in the house. So you don't need to hear my life story, though. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Aaron. My, my thoughts exactly. If you're going to buy underwear secondhand, you're going to have a bad time. Oh my gosh. Ugh. I don't want to wear someone else's junk. Dead. What's this thing do? I know what you've been up to. Gosh. It's a bit of a stalker. You know all my dirty secrets, eh? He's been writing it down in his little book. Kill things, he takes notes. Oh, I see. Oh, so you get to see all your stats and everything. Okay, that's pretty cool. Alright, well that's alright. It's good to know your progress. What's this thing do? Can't open it. You haven't had breakfast yet. You should eat, man. Has this developer made any other known games? That is a really, really good question. Um... All I'm, I'm not 100% sure, but you can buy this game bundled with Guacamole. If you remember that game, Guacamole, which was also a Metroidvania game. I have a feeling that it's the same developer. I don't want to go out and say it is and it isn't, but why would they bundle um, those two games together, you know what I mean, if it's not? So, uh, take that for what it is, but yeah, apart from that, I'm not 100% sure. I don't want to get up here. Trying to, this, is, this looks like a really hard jump. I don't know how you're supposed to get up there. Can we go back this way? Maybe we can go down here instead. No, that's really difficult. It's, uh, geez, that's the only way out. And I can't even double jump up there. Maybe we can just... Well, let's try one more time. Yeah, the double jump is... Uh, is there a secret entrance here? I think you can always kill yourself and then restart. That's no big deal. But, yeah, you're supposed to be able to go up there and you can't. So we'll restart. So, yeah, we'll restart. No big deal. Oh, thank you very much, Brian. I appreciate it, man. Um, yeah, we had a lot of fun with that. I found, I literally found the Adventure Island game on the day I streamed it. And I was like, oh, I actually plan to do something else. And I was like, nah, I really have to show you guys this. It's awesome. And, uh, how's your day, Brian? You well, man? Thanks for coming by. What's going on, sir? Alright, we're gonna keep going. Alright, um... so hard to find a damn way out here. Oh, we have to drop down? That's better. Now we're talking. Now we can actually kill stuffs. Uh, you know what? That's a very, very good question, Stacy. And honestly, that depends on my mood. That honestly depends on my mood. But I'm feeling pretty generous today, so there'll be no death matches until there's someone with the same spelling. You get a get out of jail free card. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you enjoy, it, guys. I, I I do apologize for my frequent rage when I play hard games, but oh my gosh, that Adventure Island game is every bit as hard, if not harder, than the original. It was pretty crazy. <laughs> okay, we can upgrade our stats here. I'm gonna do my absolute best to get a little bit further this time. Be a bit more careful. I was just done. Uh, thing do. You get so overwhelmed by everything, don't you? I was just learning the controls and getting used to the mechanics. I think you should be able to push on a bit more. Maybe buy some more potions or whatever. Oh, is that okay? Thank you, Aaron. Yo, yeah, well, this just left... I don't know how long it was in early access, but this literally just left early access, like... 
three days ago, I think, as far as I know. Oh, crap. I have to use a, a potion here. But it feels like it's going to take a long time before I actually make any real progress in this. Seems very, very difficult. Glad you're having a good day, by the way, and an easy day, uh... Brian, you gonna do anything in particular? Are you just gonna play some games, or...? How you doing, Curtis? Good to see you, my brother. Bro, I'm pretty good. I'm feeling really, really exhausted today, to be honest. Uh, and I don't know why, because... Um, what's this one? I've had plenty of sleep. I think that might... I don't know what that is. But yeah, I don't know. I just can't wake up for whatever reason can't go that way. We have to keep going over here. That's fine. Whatever. Let's have a look at the map. Oh, what's in there? How do I get in there? I, need... I don't even know. There's so many areas I can't get to yet. Yeah, I I've taken a chance on a lot of bad early access games, to be honest. There's a lot of infamous ones out there, like there's a game called, um, there's a, a zombie survival game, um, what was it, DayZ, I think it's called, it's been in early access for about seven years, and it's still an alpha, if you know what I mean, so, yeah, there's a lot of people pissed off about some of these early access games, for sure. It's just, yeah. <laughs> But you know what? I highly recommend getting a copy of this if you're into your Metroidvania style games. Uh, the combat's very addictive, really fluid. It's just, uh... I mean, when I played Rogue Legacy for the first time, I kind of felt like straight away I sort of knew what I was doing. This one seemed very big and overwhelming. But that could be a good thing in the scheme of things once you figure it out. Oh my gosh, this is a big-ass dungeon. Now where can we go? Okay, we can go upwards. Alright, that's fine. Let's do that. Yeah. I might try and take a small nap again before I come back on. Uh, I want to do plenty of streams today, but you know, I'm just feeling uh, a little bit flat. It happens. I don't, I, I don't like to, uh, how can I put it? What's this guy doing? Alright, oh, whatever. Dirty bed. Oh, did I ever check the PC game you told me about? Um, I've ch I check every video uh, you send me, Stacy. Check every single video you send me. I just can't remember it off the top of my head right now. But I always check every video you send me. I remember we were talking about it a good few weeks ago now. Um, now where do I go? Okay, we can go back to this uh, teleport. This, this space is really, really tricky actually. So we can teleport, go down here. I hope this is the only way I haven't been yet, guys, so... Uh, everything must go. Can't afford anything, so we'll just keep moving. You drink some white grass? I don't even know what that is, bro. You have to explain to me what that one is. I haven't... White Kratom. I feel like such a dunce. <laughs> I wonder if there's something that uh, you can pick up that will allow you to jump higher, because that's exactly what I need right now, hey. Keep moving. Just gonna... Back. There's nothing I can really do right now. I don't know where to use the blueprints yet. I know in Rogue Legacy you collect a lot of blueprints. And you take them to a vendor, but I don't know where the blueprint guy is in this yet. Alright, there we go, got another teleport. 
pay the tribute or turn back. I will pay the tribute. Upgrade our skills some more. Awesome. That will be extra strong. That's always good, right? It's T. It's illegal in a lot of places, but still legal in most states. Why is it illegal? Is it because it makes you high or something? There's this tea over in the Pacific Islands called kava that people drink. And, um... It's illegal in some places as well because it kind of gives you a sedated effect. But it's the most calming thing you can possibly have in your diet. <laughs> it's just, a, it's just a, a plant. It's just a root. A plant root. But it just has, uh... Many medicinal effects, if that makes sense. But I don't know where to get it. Alright. We gotcha. How you doing, Don? It's really good to see you. Oh, no, it's nothing nothing bad. It's just um, some natural plants just get you high, basically, Stacy. It's the best way to explain it. <laughs> That's all it is. Uh, can we jump down? This is a really, really big level, actually. What's this dude doing? She's dead. Yeah, it looks that way. And it's recent. Yeah, it looks that way. Oh. We just kicked her corpse. Oh, look what I found. There we go. You just kick dead bodies around, guys, and you find treasure. A precious stone. There we go. What's this one? And we got a broadsword blueprint. And here we go. We're going to go in the next section, finally. Don, I'm not too bad, man. I'm a little sleepy. I'm still trying to wake up and be an energetic host and everything, but my body's not cooperating with me at the moment. This game almost looks like the Castlevania. It's the same sort of gameplay. This is more of a rogue-like. So it's procedurally generated. It's a bit more uh, casual. Oh, good. Uh, I'm just trying to. Oh, just pick the combo mutation. There we go. So we're going to do stronger damage. We're going to go in the next section here. Awesome. Uh, welcome back, Father Axe Keeper. How was the trip, my friend? It's always good to see you. I needed you, actually, yesterday because I was playing a game in Japanese and I needed you to translate for me. True story. <laughs> oh, I appreciate it, Curtis. Thank you so much. Uh, message me again what it is, uh, what, what it's called later on so I don't forget. Oh crap. Oh no. I just absolutely blew it. I need to buy some health from somewhere. Oh well, keep moving. You snooze, you're losing this game, that's for sure. When you wake up, you stretch, you do push-ups, steaming hot shower and some... Yeah, I see I had something to eat, I had a shower and everything, but I'm just still feeling really flat. I don't know why, it's really weird. I don't have a regulated sleep pattern, I'm sleeping at all different times, and I think that might have something to do with it. <laughs> nice. I'll, def I'll definitely be uh, taking you up on that. Alright, so let's try this one more time. Been a little bit clumsy so far. I don't feel like I'm making any real progress yet. But, um... We need to upgrade some of our stuff when we can. Uh, beginner's bow. Ammo comes back after enemies are killed. use a bow this time. I haven't used a bow yet, so let's see how we go with that one. That's pretty cool. I like this. Bow for the win. How you doing, 
Hi Esmeralda, it's really good to see you. Welcome to One Point Only, I hope you're having a great day. Thanks for coming by, what's going on? Alright, all right, Ben, thank you so much for hanging out, brother. We'll see you next time, okay? gonna reset. I'm not really raiding the bow because everyone comes charging at me. It's uh, I think I'm gonna have to stick with the sword for now. There you go, there goes my dead ugly corpse coming back to life again. Oh, right, keep trying. Oh, we've got one more good round in us, I think. Uh, old wooden shield. Boom. Let's do it. Thank you, Curse. I appreciate it, man. Anything that helps me be at my better me. Go <laughs> big. Oh, no, I totally get it. I, I, I knew you were... Like, it's all good, Father Axe Keeper. I knew you were preoccupied with your holiday. It's all good, man. you got to have that downtime. It's important. Alright, we got it. Yeah, great. Quite, yeah, man, that sounds that sounds really neat. I haven't done a real outdoorsy trip for a long time. What's in there? Oh, just gold. All right. More gold. Uh, we don't need to pay any gold to get in that door. It's crap. How you doing, Benji? Good to see you today, my man. <laughs> I'm on TV. You make me feel famous. I'm on the TV. It's always been my dream to be on the TV. <laughs> How you doing, Benji? Good to have you, my man. What's been going on, by the way, brother? I can't afford anything yet. Seems down here. Maybe I should plan an outdoor stream. When I go on vacation, maybe in New Year if I can afford it, um, I'm thinking of maybe doing an outdoor stream on the beach for you guys. So I've definitely considered it. <laughs> I probably won't be able to go away, but I do really need a break, so I'm thinking about it. What's this thing do? Rub it. It says rub. Well, I did rub you. What's happening? Oh, I see. Better stop it. <laughs> You're moving? Um, yeah, this is this is an action RPG. This is a new game called Dead Cells. It just came out of early access on Steam. It's uh, fantastic. It's, it's, it's very, very punishing. You're not going to finish this in less than eight sittings. So we're just doing a first impressions video today. And, uh, yeah, if you guys are watching offline, I do recommend this. But it's uh, definitely not for the faint of heart. Very high difficulty in loading curve. No mechanism is keeping the door locked, apparently. Oh, okay, this mechanism. Oh, nice one. <laughs> That's really cool. What's in here? We just open that door for nothing. Oh no, we go down here now. Hmm. Alright, there's another pel teleport zone. Okay, so we're going to kick this dead body, I think, and get some stuffs. What's that? Another blueprint. Alright, we'll go in this new area and try and survive for more than five seconds this time. Uh, <laughs> yeah, well, that's what I was thinking. Okay, so you can... Oh, that's right. You can buy upgrades from this guy. I completely forgot. So, uh, it preserves up to three grand when you die. This is really, really important. And this will allow us to play through some more. 
Um, I forgot to do this the last time I went through. It's really embarrassing, but yeah, you hold three grand when you die, which means we can buy better weapons and be stronger for the next playthrough. And we get a free mutation here, which is a free upgrade. Saves you once in the event of premature death. Well, we need that. What's this thing do? Oh, that's it. Keep moving. There we go. Sort of feeling my way around now. <laughs> I'm gonna, um, after this run is done, now that I've got some upgrades, I'm gonna try at least one more run after this and see if we can get a little, I really wanna see a boss. We haven't seen a boss or anything yet. Oh crap, really? I did that last time. Oh no, come on, Rick. Don't screw it up. Okay, we're okay this time. Uh, okay, we'll go underground first. Crap. Now you lose health if you fall too far as well. This door was sealed one minute ago. That's nice. How you doing, Dennis? Good to see you today, my brother. Thanks for coming in. Trenton, New Jersey in the house. Always good to have you. It's usually where I die, isn't it, guys? never get any further than this. Is there anything we need over here? I uh, probably should stay away from all that. <laughs> oh, gosh. I'm just trying to find a, 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 like a, a, a store vendor or something. Okay, just uh, see what's down here. Any secret food? There is. See, it's pretty cool. It's like Castlevania. You can find, like, warm meat, warm cake and stuff. Oh, you just watched The Karate Kid 2 this morning? I love that movie, bro. You never watched the third? Um, no. Th well. Um. Oh, crap. Really? Oh, that sucks. That really sucks. I've got one hit point left. Um, the third Karate Kid is a pretty weak movie, but it has a very, very good villain. Um... Terry Silver is the main character in that game, and uh, he's a really, really good villain. He's a fun character, but the movie's a little bit weak. It's not dreadful, it's just average. Oh, thank you, Benji. Oh, thank you, Stacy, honey. I appreciate it. Stacy, I'm going to send you some Rocky Balboa. Yo, I did it! I did it! But you're a sweetheart, honestly. You don't need to give me anything, girl. I'm just happy you keep me company every day. <laughs> How you doing, Ada? It's good to see you. Thank you very much again, Stacy. Ten dollar super chat. Ten dollar super chat from a superwoman. Oh wait, what happened? I thought I was dead. Oh yeah, I got resurrected. That's right. I forgot I had the free resurrect in this. Still going for about a whole of two seconds. Ah shit. Oh well, we're going to try one more playthrough, guys. I know we can make good headway this time. What's in here? Oh, this is the gold I... Okay, so we still got some gold. I just feel like this is going to be like Dark Souls, guys, and I'm just going to be going over and over and over and over and over. So, <laughs> oh, we'll uh, see what we can do though. There we go, we've got a shield. Yeah, definitely, see if you're a fan of Karate Kid, it's worth watching the third movie. The only Karate Kid movie I thought was really crappy was the one with Hilary Swank. It's just not Karate Kid without Daniel Sun, you know what I mean? Oh, it's a pretty good game, actually. I mean, this is my, this is my, I, like I've been streaming for 45 minutes, and this is the first time I've ever played this. And uh, it's, I've got a lot to learn, but it seems pretty good on first impressions. Is that just a whole pile of gold? This is 
far from this is 2D Dark Souls. I can't get past the second level and I've been on for 45 minutes. It's Dark Souls. <laughs> uh, I suppose Dark Souls is a completely different... Uh, I don't know, I see the similarities, that's all I'm saying. Oh my gosh. The game's just getting harder and harder. Uh. Alright, well, we're gonna go down here. It says an upgrade, we need that. Oh, dude's in the way. I'm almost dead already. I'm gonna have to use my potion. Oh, we got him. This is a free upgrade, finally. How you doing, Gareth? Good to see you today. Hey, Danielle. Thanks for coming in, my friend. How's your work day? Hope you're absolutely fantastic, as always. We're playing this new game called Dead Cells. It's very interesting. The name definitely suits the title of the game, because I'm finding myself becoming a dead cell every two seconds. Yeah, lame, I know, but it's true. Someone's groaning on the other side. No answer. You're probably interrupting a happy couple. <laughs> it's very interesting. Oh, there we go, got free meat. Got free wall meat. Oh, thank you, Sorcerer. I just hope I don't get so stuck forever. I mean, that's what you expect in these games, but I just want to show you guys some different levels and stuff, that's all. Oh, I've got full health again. There's another up, okay. I've got a ton of gold, maybe I can buy some decent weapons soon. Infantry bow. Oh, it's just a blueprint. Work is Blair lately. Yeah, you and Jared have been saying it's been... Oh, I hope it gets better for you guys. I, I hate to see you guys down. Have a quick look down here. Green shield. Oh, there you go. This is Benji's favorite weapon. Absorbs 75 damage. Blocked attacks make the enemy's teeth fall out. Transforms arrows into gold. Hey, I'm so I'm so down for that. Cool. We got the green shield. Apparently, <laughs> I like that. And uh, we get to kick this dead body again. Okay, so this is the entrance to the next level. I want to look for some items for a little bit at first. She is dead. Okay, sometimes you can kick her. So don't mind me. I'm just going to have a quick look over here for a little minute. Yeah, no, I get it. I hope you guys can do something nice together soon. A tank build is your favourite? <sighs> yeah, you know, I like building a tank as well, my friend. I'm just not very good at it. Um, I don't know. I think I'm more suited to a DPS. Just brainless damage, you know what I mean? <laughs> Everything must go. What's this weapon do? So, okay. Carefully balance for rapid attack sequences. 1% of hit point received per attack. Okay, this is a really good weapon. We're going to get that. So, we're going to replace the rusty sword. Happy birthday. There we go. We actually got something with the money, guys. And uh, I guess we can go to the next level section. Uh, if we stop killing ourselves free-falling. Oh, awesome. Let's see what's in here. How much is this game? This game is currently $20. I think it's on a small sale at the moment. I think it's $19.99 US. And how you doing today, JY? Are you well? Let's talk to him. So we got 10 cells. Uh, we're gonna... Health potion can be used two times. This preserves up to six. Yeah, we're gonna have to save up for that, hey. That'll be really, really helpful in the end game. Well done, Mr. Prisoner, sir. Gonna mutate. Yeah, we should be a lot s stronger this round. So I'll just try and go through this, through this a little bit s slower, but... 
I think we're going to do a lot better now. Yeah, it's pretty decent, man. Did you play Street Fighter the movie arcade video game live on YouTube? Nah, Dwayne is going to do that for you really soon though, Dennis. You know, you know my friend Dwayne that you watch as well. He loves his fighting games. So we're going to look after you, my friend. We just never know when you're on. Pretty strong here, as you can see, I'm doing a lot of damage. Oh man, did you see how much health I just lost? Oh wow. Oh, you kidding me? Oh, that sucks. Oh, you. Fuck. Oh, come on. <laughs> can you st oh my gosh. This game's not going to cut me a break anytime soon, is it? Oh, I'm going to have to try again. <laughs> Shit. I'll be real quick. This is probably just... Oh my gosh. I can't survive more than five minutes. Oh, that was... You can't stay longer today? First encounter... Alright, thanks. Thank you, Aida. You take care, hey? Let's just get through it. I don't, I'm not sure how long this stream's gonna go for yet, but I am gonna be on multiple times today as well as Headlock Gaming. Just in case you're wondering. This is kind of the day's warm up, I suppose you could say. Have I ever tried Infamous? I know the game, but I've never ever played it myself. Is it worth trying? Here we go, we've got some health up here. Didn't like the bow. Now I tried to use the bow. Um, I found that all the enemies would lunge at you, and it wasn't doing enough damage to uh, kill everyone before you got attacked, if that makes sense. But, uh, yeah, the bow was, I mean, a strong bow would be good, that one's, the opening bow is a little bit tedious. Oh, we gotcha. Let's try this one again. First encounter assault recon, yes. Finding plenty of wall cake in this game. Yeah, it kind of has that root. I love the atmosphere. The music's good. The graphics are good. This is so freaking hard. Why does this game have to be so hard? You get to tickle these guts for whatever reason. <laughs> Here's another crack. See you, Ada. We'll see you soon, hey? Thanks for coming in to hang out with us today. I'm honestly going to give it my best shot this time, guys. I'm sick of dying always. The door's locked. I think we have to go up here and press a switch or something. How you doing, Orchid? Good to see you today, Orchid. Hope you're well. There we go. That's the one. Is there any wall meat here or something? No. Keep tickling the guts. Maybe later. I like to keep my fetishes behind closed doors, thank you very much. You bet something happens. Ah, uh, well, we'll find another pile of guts somewhere. <laughs> I feel so dirty doing it. I don't know what that thing does. Pay tribute or turn back. I don't want to really waste my money on the door. Alright, we got your sucker. Oh, there we go. Here's some more guts. Tickle. <laughs> I don't know what it's supposed to do. Look at it. Tickle, tickle, tickle. You know, most normal kids play in the sand or the mud. I'm playing in guts. Go figure. <laughs> Whatever, whatever is your hobby, whatever floats your boat, everything must go. I 
can't afford anything, bitch. Oh, there's another teleport. You're tired, but you're good, I can imagine. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay, we got three items. Infantry grenade inflicts 63 damage. Okay, so what's right trigger? Okay, so it, it's got a cooldown rate. That's pretty cool. Let's keep moving here. What's in here? Oh, what's in here? Uh, pay the tribute. Okay, fine. We'll just pay the tribute. Whatever. Twin daggers. Okay, I've never used twin daggers before, so why not? Hey, that looks pretty neat. Squishy. <laughs> Oh gosh. I'll see if they're playing LA Noir at some point today, guys. Would you be interested in seeing that? I might come on and do some LA Noir afterwards as well. Do you remember that game? I think it's one of the most underrated games ever released, to be honest. I feel like being a detective today. It's kind of more my pacing. How you doing, Matthew? Good to see you. Thanks for coming in, sir. Choose an upgrade. 15 plus damage with red items. Well, we got all red items on. And, uh, is there anything down here? Please, sir. No, no, no health or anything. Keep moving. And how's your day going so far, bro? What are you up to? Yeah, I've been meaning to stream that for a long time. Did I shrink? Oh, cool. I'm glad you guys are happy with that. I'm relieved. Yeah, cool. We're going to start doing a playthrough of that then. And uh, we won't do it every day, but we'll do it like every couple days until it's finished. Now, I haven't finished LA Noir before, actually, but I've gotten very close. So, uh, it'll take a lot of big sittings to get through it. Been dead for a while. Can we kick his body? Before we go in there, we're going to have one more check down this corridor. There's a writing on the wall. The writing is barely legible. It's pretty neat, hey? <laughs> I shall call him Squishy. Oh, I think the soundtrack's epic. It's just dark. And Stacy says, I shall call him Squishy and he shall be mine and he shall be my... <laughs> I can't remember what show I heard that from. It's pretty funny, though. Alright, there we go. It's all forced... Okay. Well, let's keep going. I think this is the only way we've got to go. What's this item? Throws two traps that immobilize enemies and increase the damage they take. Ah, that could be helpful. There we go, we've got a trap now too. Oh, was it from Finding Nemo? Gosh, I haven't seen that movie in years. I knew, I, I knew it was familiar. Okay, so we've got nine cells. We're going to chuck them all in the gold reserves here. That will upgrade very, very soon. Awesome. Hello, Mr. Prisoner. How are you doing? It's good to have you. We're going to get um, a free revive, so we'll be able to last in here longer. All right, let's try this one more time. I can now see your stream in a black background in here, but it says video is unavailable. Just try and refresh, sir. <laughs> Usually backing out and coming back in should help that, Gareth. Oh, crap. Uh, double jump over here. Yep, no problem. This level makes me incredibly nervous. I don't know what these doors are supposed to be, they're really odd. Anyway. 
whatever. <laughs> I don't hate Pixar. Well, I miss the old cartoons I used to watch in my childhood, you know what I mean? The only Pixar type sort of show I really got into was Shrek. And only the original, not the sequels. I do remember Finding Nemo, it seemed okay. I just miss my old school cartoons. Uh, I'm not really helping my cause, am I? <laughs> Damn, 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 damn. Oh, no. This is not going so well right now. <laughs> Get out of here. Alright, off to safety. Uh, all the, the connection all seems okay on my end, guys. But, you know, sometimes, as you all know, there's problems with... Either my connection or YouTube and whatever. Usually if you just back out and come back in, it's okay. Oh my goodness, I've got very little health left already. I thought in this game you'd gain experience and stuff, but that doesn't seem to be the case. It seems you have to upgrade every one of your stats with gold. Or are those souls that you collect? So it is pretty similar to Dark Souls in a sense. Let's see what's over here. Oh, Dwayne's in here as well. Hey, you going, Headlock Gaming? Good to see you, man. Thanks for coming in. All right, I'm gonna play through one more. I'm really hooked on this game, guys. So I'm gonna play through one more time when we die, and hopefully we can improve. Nothing I can really do down here. Just items for sale. I don't have enough money. Oh gosh. Ah man. I've got like 90 points left. Oh, as you can see, I'm getting a little bit further every time. It's not saying a lot, but you slow, it's like slow improvements, I guess you could say. Can we just, there we go. Oh, the traps are really helpful. So I used the trap for the first time there, that was really neat. That was the difference between life and death, literally. <laughs> Broadband Network, Australian Internet. Yeah, I don't even have the new NBN. We have the crappy ADSL One. It's the most primitive like internet in the whole world. The only thing worse than ADSL One is dial-up. It's an absolute miracle I can actually hold a stream together for you guys. That's why I have so many problems. But that won't be forever. Oh, nice. That'd be unique to see. Yeah, you're absolutely killing Zelda, Dwayne. You're gonna have to t I'm going to have to watch those videos and learn what to do. What's in here? Yeah, I really need some, like, wall meat or something. I will <laughs> play with these guts again. I don't know what playing with the guts does. No, that's alright, Hawk. Did you talk about what you feel like, my friend? We're not just about games, we're all about community and stuff, too. Ah. Oh. Well, that sucks. Sucks to be me. Alright, we're gonna try one more time, guys. I'm kinda hooked on this and I wanna get further. <laughs> Ah, uh, thank you, Matthew. That means a lot. I think between myself and Dwayne here, we we managed to brainstorm and find a lot of interesting, cool stuff. So, I mean, st st uh, the stuff that you can find on Steam, Matthew, is just absolutely amazing. 
like um, just all these independent developers bringing out like uh, all these new ideas and just improving on old ones. This is great. But I have to I have to thank uh, John for this one. This was, this was a kind donation from him yesterday. And uh, I really wish he was here. He'd love to watch this. But uh, I'll tell him about the replay anyway. We're all going to be there cheering you on, my friend. I hope you kick the hell out of every other opponent, my friend. I hope you rip out multiple spines in that tournament, Wayne, and I hope you kick everyone's ass. <laughs> I understand why they're using the Super Nintendo version, because kids can play because it's less gory. It's a whole PC thing, isn't it? A bit lame, but I understand. <laughs> I really, oh gosh, I'm almost dead already. This is not an improvement. <laughs> Wow. Oh, awesome, Orchard. That'd be awesome. That'd be really, really cool. Okay, this is this is the last one. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna play through this one last time, then I'm gonna set up LA Noir. Okay. I just want one more decent run. Yeah, that's, that's why they're doing it. You should slip in the blood hack, bro. You should get the reproduction cart and switch it over. <laughs> Man. There we go, we got some food. Yeah, you're gonna kill it, bro. Oh, awesome. <laughs> I'm glad you've enjoyed this game today, guys. As I said, this is called Dead Cells. Um, this is a new game that just came out of Early Access on Steam. It's about $20 at the moment. It's a lot of fun. It's going to give you a lot of gameplay because it's going to take you hours to actually get strong enough to finish this. Um, definitely worth your time, I think. Alright, so Balance Blade. Rapid attack sequences. Okay, we'll take it. Oh, that's pretty quick. Alright, nice. Uh, there, there's, oh, there's no save points. It's like once you die, you have to start all over again. It's a procedurally generated game. It's a rogue. So it just goes by playthrough. It's not uh, a normal RPG, if that makes sense. Okay, another blueprint. Yeah, that's why we're not going to stay here forever, otherwise we'll go crazy. Grinding wasn't just getting a straight XP. Like, again, you have to collect gold and be lucky enough to find somewhere to upgrade. Alright, we got you. Ah, there we go. These things are good. Another stat boost. get an energy drink before I do my next stream. <laughs> oh my gosh, my breakfast hasn't kicked in yet, guys. You know, that's a, that's exactly what the problem's been, to be honest. This whole week I've been cutting down on my sugar and uh, trying to behave, look after my diet. And, uh... 
can't even put together a sentence at the moment. Alright, oh, I'm gonna use a potion here. Alright. What's up here? There we go, another one. I'm glad you like it. Yeah, man. I don't know if this is coming out in consoles as well. I would assume this probably is. Been dead for a while. Sometimes you can kick these bodies and get stuff, but not this time. Let's just have a look at this map. Uh, we've more or less gone everywhere in here, so... We're going to take the exit. Unless there's a, a teleport here, we can warp around. We haven't checked this top section yet, so let's go have a quick look. Yeah, sounds good, Aaron. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today, my friend. Always appreciate your company, sir. And that's not a problem, my friend. We've all got places to do, people to see. Did I say places to do? Things to do. <laughs> oh, gosh. I will just shut up right now. Ah, but seriously, good to see you, brother. Okay, now we can leave. So this is going to be our last run, six cells, so we can upgrade our gold reserves again next time, get a free upgrade and we're going to obviously buy this uh, free resurrect. I haven't found any of those special uh, items yet, which is a bullet. like we don't have any traps or anything like last time. People to do places to see. <laughs> yeah. Kind of makes it sound a bit more kinky, doesn't it? Uh, can't quite jump up there. Stop going in the freaking door, you stupid spaz. Come on. Okay, that's better. There's always those things causing me a headache last time. Keep moving. Gotcha. Sorry, bombs automatically. I don't know why I'm doing that. I must have got an upgrade of that. It's pretty cool though. Right, we're getting some souls there. Crap. It's another checkpoint. I can't put together a coherent sentence today. There we go, this one's looking to be a lot stronger than the last one. Let's have a look down here. Fifteen plus damage and hit points with red items. So one, there you go, you can see we're getting stronger. Oh crap. Sweep the leg. How you doing, Steve? I'm totally planning on sweeping the leg a little bit later on, sir. We're hoping to get plenty of leg sweepage in. How's your, how's your morning going, my friend? What have you been up to? Well, it's afternoon now. My bad. Well, what's in the well? It's dark down there. Well, no shit. Not that I'm scared, of course not. You're, you're a big, brave dog. But I'm getting tired of driving, diving into blackness and... Oh, yeah, excuses, excuses. Oh, you're such a pussy, whatever. <laughs> I didn't start it on purpose. All right. got another power. Oh, what's this thing do? Knife dance. Okay, that's just a blueprint, so we need to save that. I don't know how to use the blueprints, that's the only thing. I'll work that out in Google later on. But I mean, if you played Rogue Legacy, the blueprints you'd take to a vendor 
And then you could spend gold and they build a weapon for you, but... Man, whatever. We'll work it out. way further this time. This is awesome. Finally. Finally a good run. <laughs> this will definitely be a good one to finish off while we're ahead. Alright, what's down here? Another checkpoint. Alright, it's a store. How much gold do we got? Plenty, actually. Uh, Electro Whip. Automatically targets nearby enemies, ignore shields. That's actually really, really good. And plus, okay. That's what's up. We're getting this. Actually, no, we're not. I thought it was good, but it's overrated. Anyway. <laughs> oh, you lady. Seriously, you're going to make me blush in a minute. No, it's not, it's not me, it's not the person, it's a Karate Kid headband, don't lie. No one would even know it existed if it wasn't for the Karate Kid headband, but because I'm wearing the headband, everyone's going crazy. <laughs> oh no, lame joke. We gotcha. And don't forget, if we die, we have a free resurrect as well. Give me one second, guys. Oh. Sorry about that. I got a message, and I'd, I always like to check just in case it's an emergency. I try to do the right thing. Didn't mean to be unprofessional there. <laughs> Downwards or so I don't even know where to go yet. Let's go down here. Come on, we need some wall food. Anything down here? Nope. Why can't we get him? Why are they invincible? I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna get the fudge out of here. Nothing can, nothing good can come from it. <laughs> Blame the bandana. Oh, it's gonna be so much fun to meet you guys. You're awesome. I'm actually currently planning a lot of trips to the United States at the moment, guys, for a lot of more conferences. So, um, it's going to be awesome. We're going to have a great time, I think. Inflicts 96 damage. Oh, that's free, I think. Yeah, nice. Okay. And we're going to play in the guts again. <laughs> oh, jeez. You guys. What's in here? So lost. <laughs> oh, okay, this is where we died last time, wasn't it? Okay, so we're going to resurrect here. Oh no, come on, die. Damn it, we didn't make it. Oh, I think it's like a mini boss or something. Son of a bish. Oh well, I gave it my best go. Well, I'm going to log off for 20 minutes and I'm going to come back on with another game. This is just a first impression, but this is Dead Cells for PC. This just came out of early access today. And uh, it's at 1.0 on Steam. It's a roguelike. It's sort of like a procedurally generated Castlevania-style game. 
and uh, it's absolutely fantastic. It's incredibly difficult. If you've played Ro Rogue Legacy before, um, you're going to be right at home with this one. It's essentially the same. It's a lot darker and a lot more gruesome. Definitely check it out. $20, you're going to get your money's worth with this. Thank you to the developers who brought this game out. You did an absolutely fantastic job. And, uh, okay, I'm going to set up the next stream. Thank you so much for coming in, guys. We'll be right back. And, uh, as always, we're going to go over here, pull up the one coin only store for everyone watching offline if they'd like to get a hoodie or a tee. And, uh, the Sunbish Angels are out to play, aren't they, Orchard? All of his. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys in 20 minutes. Thanks for coming in. Have a great day.